I'm gonna play another round of Super Wagon Adventure. This time my capture is gonna pick it up the right way. Instead of last time, where it didn't for whatever reason. Let's do it! There's that weird fucking wagon wheel again. Let's put it on medium, that way we get a better chance to read it. 1830 and 1870, nearly half a million Americans migrated west over wagon trails. This is a story of a party of three... Yeah. Yeah, that still looks good. Let's do it again. They traveled in their trusty wagon. Uh, this time let's actually... Use a train. They set off into the forest on their train. Jordan became ill with space rabies. What? Jordan, no! It's some animals in upcoming. <laughs> Clearly, they hurried ahead. They needed to stock up on food for the long journey. Five seconds out of the gate, and Jordan got space rabies. Oh. Oh, interesting. It gives us a different weapon. To start with. There were a lot of squirrels. Uh, this is disintegrating them and I'm not picking them up. Posse of bandits interrupted the hunt. Escape the bandits, they accidentally rode into a cave. Ah! Spiders. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, God. Finally, they found their way out of the cave. Jordan recovered from space rabies. Uh, good on you, Jordan? Left the wagon to look for wild berries. Mmm, delicious. His way back to notice an entrance to a cave. He was optimistic this cave would be different, so he decided to investigate. Ah. <sighs> it was very dark inside. One lighting torch, it was filled with giant bats. I mean, that is... Theoretically different. Use our fucking steam gun. Turn from the cave back to the wagon. They reached a river crossing. Had the brilliant idea to try to jump over. Alternatively, they could ford it. Ah, uh, we're gonna ford it this time. Fuck you, Jordan. <laughs> there were boulders in the river. There were a lot of boulders in the river. Something, something boulders. Finally, they reached the other side of the river. Ow. Stupid boulders. They entered into the Great Plains. They came across a large herd of buffalo. And you know what they say about buffalo. There's enough forever. And this steam gun is going to get me killed. Some angry buffalo charged the wagon. I was gored by a bison and died. Bison headbutted Fistleb and killed him. Now it's Jordan all by him was lonesome. Jordan came across a fur trader. 
offered a smaller, easier to maneuver wagon for 51 animal hides. Uh, yeah. Traded for a smaller, easier to maneuver wagon. Oh, it just set me. <sighs> there was a tornado. Oh, Jesus. The wagon was picked up by the tornado. Along with some buffalo. Ah ha! Oh, I was still got the steam gun. Oh, a flying buffalo killed Jordan. And did the, <laughs> the wagon was smashed about into buffalo. Okay, well I hate that train wagon. Let's go adventuring. Let's go We're just going to set off in the regular wagon. Seen some animals in an upcoming clearing. They hurried ahead. They needed to stock up on food for the long journey. This Jordan didn't get space rabies this time. Remember, you don't want the skunks. Posse of bandits interrupted the hunt. I, I don't know. Are we shooting stink rounds at them? But now we stink, so we don't really care. I mean, I'm not really complaining that much. It's ended giving us food. That's not giving us food. They accidentally rode into a cave. A cave with fucking spiders. Found some edible mushrooms. Uh, Jordan, you don't want to eat those mushrooms. Whatever, just eat them anyways. Nom 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 nom. He felt funny on the way back to the wagon. Ah, he battled his inner demons. The bow and arrow. <laughs> no, stay away. Good job, Jordan. Painful memories. Bounced around in his head. Ow. Like that time he got space rabies. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Hours later, Jordan returned to reality and the wagon. Okay. They reached a river crossing. Hey, you know what? Let's jump it. That was a better idea before. Gust of air pulled them up into low Earth orbit. Oh. They passed through a meteor shower. Jordan, why? What have you done, Jordan? Why have you cursed us this way? Ow. They came across a strange machine. Oh, fuck you, satellite. I mean, I don't know what in tarnation you are, you metal dragon. But I will slay you. The wagon fell out of orbit. By chance, they landed on the same river they had jumped over days before. Oh, got a shuttle. Fuck 
fucking boulders. They entered into the Great Plains. Large herd of buffalo. Some angry buffalo charged the wagon. That's... That's not nice. <laughs> I came across fur trader. How much does he want? Trade them to replace their pistol for 50 animal hides? Yeah, I have no idea what that is. Oh, it's a glitch gun. There was a tornado. Uh oh, here we're doing the tornado thing again. Ah, oh, Jordan was killed by a fly flying buffalo. Ah, oh, no. A wagon axle broke. The wagon was stuck. This sleb left the wagon to walk to the nearest trading post miles away. It's awfully brave of you, this sleb. Especially with all the coyotes out and about. I like that he is actually pointing the gun at himself. No! It was a long journey. Filled with coyotes. Star filled nights. And coyotes! And a big bright moon. Along with the sound of many coyotes. Worth it, Richard. Oh, we reach the trading post. Placement Axel cost all of Fist Lab's money, and then he had to travel back. Oh boy. Ah. Uh. Oh no, he ripped out Fist Lab's jugular. Oh. Oh no. <laughs> oh, now I have to go to the trading post. Go me. Oh, I got hit anyways. Upon a camp of sleeping travelers. Travelers who left their supplies sitting out in the camp. He was tempted to steal the supplies. More than tempted. Uh, he decided to steal the supplies. Felt bad for stealing the supplies, but knew he'd need all that he could get. I reached the trading post. Cost all my money, and then I had to fucking go back. Eh. Eh. Found the bodies of the travelers he'd stolen from. It seems without the supplies they had starved to death. Well, that could have been me, so... Uh... One life for three is, is, uh, is an okay trade? Probably not. Hmm. 
You killed us! Yeah, but, uh... Hey, don't worry about it. This one was too deep to ford. <laughs> I already went underwater last, uh, one of the other times. So we're gonna go around. An experienced traveler named Daniel. Uh-huh. After he joined Big O's party as a guide in exchange for 49 animal hides. Unfortunately, he didn't have enough... ...avoided venomous snakes. giant scorpions were even more deadly. Say what? Oh. And they chased me. Okay. Oh, the poison from the... On a spirit journey, he talked to a spirit animal, a mongoose, then he died. Ah! Uh... Anyway, it was slowly buried under the hot sands of the desert. Well, good. All right, let's go adventure. Let's try one more time. See what kind of wacky things happen. They traveled in their trusty wagon, a space shuttle. Jordan came down with food poisoning. <laughs> Why are we all starting out at two hearts? Uh huh. Oh no, bandits. Jordan still has food poisoning, apparently. Oh, fuck. Oh no. He never had a chance to recover from his food poisoning. Slab, no. Move the web wagon to look for wild berries. Noise in the trees. A bear wanted the berries. Get the fuck off, bear. Bear left out a cry for help. A swarm of rabid squirrels heard the cry. Mmm, I bet this. Damn it, I almost had the chance. Ah. Uh. Oh, whoops. I didn't actually mean to ford it. There were a lot of boulders in the river. Something, something, boulders. Oh. Okay. We 
just the other side of the river. Wait. Okay. Entered into the Great Plains. Came across a large herd of buffalo. No, this is going to be me dead here in a second, because I couldn't possibly get that health. Oh. <laughs> Bigger later choked to death on his own vomit while unconscious. Oh. Oh, that's unfortunate. in a minute with something different but I think I'm done with this one for now oh that's what that wagon wheel was this whole time see you guys later no wait that's not right 